Hello everyone. In this video, I'll show you how to use a pivot table in Excel for a long format table. As an example, we'll calculate the average monthly price for each cryptocurrency, like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin. A long format table means each row represents a single entry. In this case, one price entry for one coin in one month. So instead of having one row per coin with multiple columns for each month, we have many rows for the same coin, each tied to a specific month and price. This format is typical when downloading crypto price data from a site like Yahoo Finance, but you'll also find long format tables in other places too. Click anywhere in the table, go to the Insert tab, click Pivot Table. In the dialog box, it should auto-select your data. Unless you have an empty row, then it will only select the table up to that point. So make sure the entire table is selected. Choose to place the pivot table on a new worksheet, then click OK. Now let's build it out. Drag coin into the rows area. Drag month into the columns area. Drag price to the values area. This gives us a grid with the coins down the side and the months across the top, showing the monthly price for each coin. As you can see here, it defaulted to the sum of the price. Let's pull down the menu choose value field settings, select average, and I would rename the column to average price. Before we leave the window, let's clean up the format by clicking on number format, select currency, and click OK. And there we have it. If this helped you out, hit the like button, subscribe, and ask any questions in the comments, and also share what you would like to see next, maybe a wide format version. Thanks for watching. Try it, learn it 365. Until next time.